गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल टुडे वी विल डिस्कस वन मोर क्वेश्चन ऑन चेन कोड सो इन दिस क्वेश्चन बाउंड्री ऑफ एन इमेज इट इज गिवन टू अस एंड वी हैव टू कंप्यूट ए डायरेक्शनल चेन कोड विच इज इनवेरियंट टू द स्टार्टिंग पॉइंट एंड विच इज इनवेरियंट टू बोथ स्टार्टिंग पॉइंट एंड द रोटेशन सो लेट अस सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट वी विल डिटरमाइन the eight directional chain code which is invariant to the starting point to solve this question let us draw the eight directional code in a directional code this direction it is assigned with a directional code 0 it is with 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 <coughs> so look at in this question a starting point it is not given to us so let us assume this is my starting point theek hai let us assume this is my origin this is my starting point from which i will start uh, start moving across this boundary so this direction in eight directional code it is assigned with a directional code 5 so i will write here 5 next this direction in eight directional code it is assigned with a directional code 7 so i will write here 7 next this downward direction in a directional code it is assigned with a directional code 6 this downward direction in a directional code it is assigned with a directional code 6 so i will write here 6 similarly this inclined direction in a directional code it is assigned with a directional code 1 so i will write here 1 similarly this forward direction it is assigned with a directional code 0 so i will write here 0 this upward direction in a directional code it is assigned with a directional code 2 so i will write here 2 next this inclined direction in a directional code it is assigned with a directional code 3 so i will write here 3 and this reverse direction in a directional code it is assigned with a directional code 4 so i will write here 4 since this is my starting point this is my origin so the eight directional chain code for this boundary it becomes 57610234 so first we will write the chain code the chain code of this boundary it is 5761 okay now eight directional chain code which is invariant to the starting point it means we have to determine the normalized chain code normalized chain code normalized chain code it means the minimum magnitude or the smallest magnitude of this chain code so the smallest magnitude of this chain code it is 02345761 so 02345 5761 इस चेन कोड का स्मॉलेस्ट नंबर या मिनिमम मैग्नीट्यूड नंबर क्या होगा इसका मिनिमम मैग्नीट्यूड और स्मॉलेस्ट मैग्नीट्यूड नंबर होगा 02345761 02345761 दैट इज द नॉर्मलाइज्ड चेन कोड ऑफ दिस बाउंड्री 
and this normalized chain code it is invariant to the starting point next we next we will solve the second part we have to determine the eight directional chain code which is invariant to both starting point and the rotation so we will proceed in the similar manner first we will draw the eight directional code Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And for simplicity, let us consider again this point. It is my starting point. We will assign directional code to each arrow. So this inclined arrow, we have to assign the directional code five. So I will write here five. This inclined arrow, we will assign the directional code seven. Similarly, this downward arrow, this down arrow, it is assigned with a directional code six. So I will write here six. This inclined arrow in eight directional code, it is assigned with a directional code one. So I will write here one. This forward direction in eight directional code, it is assigned with a directional code zero. So I will write here zero. Next, this upward direction, it is assigned with a directional code two. So I will write here two. This inclined direction it is assigned with a directional code three, so I will write here three. And this reverse direction it is assigned with a directional code four, so I will write here four. Okay, considering this is my origin, considering this is my starting point, so the chain code of this boundary it becomes five seven six one zero two three four. So first I will write the chain code. That is five seven six one zero two three four. Next, invariant eight directional chain code, which is invariant to both starting point and rotation. It means we have to determine the shape number. So after writing the chain code, in order to determine the shape number. Next, we have to determine the first difference. First difference between five to seven. Between five to seven in anti-clockwise direction, it is one two. So I will write here two. Next, the difference between seven to six in anti-clockwise direction. Seven to six in anti-clockwise direction, it is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I will write here seven. Next, the difference between six to one in anti-clockwise direction, six to one in anti-clockwise direction, it is one, two, three. So I will write here three. Next, the difference between one to zero, difference between one to zero. In anti-clockwise direction, it is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I will write here seven. Next, the difference between zero to two in anti-clockwise direction, zero to two in anti-clockwise direction, the difference it is one, two. So I will write here two. Next, the difference between two to three in anti-clockwise direction, two to three in anti-clockwise direction, it is one. And next, the difference between three to four in anti-clockwise direction, three to four in anti-clockwise direction, it is one. After determining the first difference, next we will determine the circular first difference. In order to determine the circular first difference, first we will write the first difference that is two seven three seven two one one, followed by the difference between the last bit of the chain code and the starting bit of the chain code. So in this chain code, the last bit it is four, 
and the starting beat or the first beat it is 5 so the difference between the last beat and the first beat that is the difference between 4 to 5 in anti clockwise direction 4 to 5 in anti clockwise direction it is 1 so i will write here 1 next in order to determine the shape number next in order to determine the shape number we have to compute the minimum magnitude number or the smallest number of this circular first difference so the minimum magnitude number or the smallest number of this circular first difference it is 1 1 1 2 7 3 7 2 so 1 1 1 Two seven three seven two. It is the shape number of this given boundary. Okay, so one 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 two seven three seven two, which is the shape number of this given boundary. It is the eight directional chain code, which is invariant to both the starting point and the rotation. Similarly, zero two three four. 5761 it is the normalized chain code of this given boundary or in other words 02345761 it is the eight directional chain code which is invariant to the starting point thank you